The project would never have existed were it not for the discovery in blank of blank. The remarkably progressed vicariant evolution fungus that we commonly term the mutamycete. Mutamycety? I don't know. <laughs> the fabrication method for each bioweapon was to introduce the mutamycety genome to a pre-stage 4 human embryo and perform cultivation in a controlled environment over a period of 38 to 40 weeks. Is that human embryo eventually Evelyn? I don't know. The resultant organisms were referred to as candidate specimens and graded based on usability from the impractical and faulty series A through D to the perfected E series. Yeah, this is perfect. Yeah, all this. Th th this looks perfect. A common appearance was selected for the bioweapons, that of a roughly 10-year-old girl, to ensure ease of blending in with urban slash refugee populations. Nice. The first E-series specimen named Evelyn, called it, has proven capable of secreting the mutamycete blank from her tissue at will. Is that necrotoxin? Maybe N-E-C-R-O-T-O-X. It's not enough spaces, but who knows. It is also of note that Evelyn's mutamycety imposes a profound control over body and mind when introduced into a host organism. We still have a lot to learn about the mechanism by which Evelyn achieves and maintains this control, but the working theory is that the vector is similar to the autoinducer pheromones used for quorum sensing in pseudo pseudomonas bacteria. My god. Spelling test on Friday. <laughs> Evelyn's control is exerted in a series of discrete stages, the first of which is hallucination. Almost immediately after infection, the subject begins to see images of Evelyn, though she's not in fact there, and even hear her voice, which is inaudible to anyone else. Yeah, thanks for, thanks for, what, thanks for the definition of what hallucinations are. We know. <laughs> Auditions with infected subjects throughout the stages of infection reveal that at first, the phantom Evelyn appears to be a normal young girl, sometimes desiring companionship or assistance, as time progresses, she begins making more and more extreme demands, including self-mutilation, ooh, and attacks on other people. The psychological shock this induces helps to break down the mind's natural barriers to Evelyn's brainwashing effect. Eh. And by the time mental control is achieved, the mutamycety infection has progressed throughout the body cells, so the body metamorphosis metamorphosizes. Who the fuck knows? Okay, wait, nope, turn it around. Is there anything on the back? Nope, okay, nothing I can read anyway. Check in here. Check over here. Making sure I don't leave anything behind. Is this more fucking reading? Oh my god! <laughs> I'm finally back in this game and I get like a whole episode of exposition. God damn it. Evelyn's functions also include the ability to form organisms from mycelia, the fungal filaments. I know what mycelium. I know what mycelia is. Mycelium is. Yeah, that's, um... Sort of like the fungal network in like jungles and stuff that all mushrooms and fungus are connected to underground. That's uh, that's mycelia. Game theory taught me that one. <laughs> uh, also watching a lot of planet Earth. The term organism is used loosely here. Strictly speaking, they are superior organisms formed of countless mycelia. What's important though is that they exhibit a strong survival instinct and will defend themselves ferociously with the slightest provocation. Their fungal toughness and remarkable strength give them significant battlefield potential. The researchers have been calling these superorganisms the molded, made of mold, and also molded as in shaped. The name has a certain elegance to it. Yeah, sure. Sure, yeah, that's the word that comes to mind whenever I come face to face with those things. Elegant. Yeah, that's the word. For the treatment of accidental infections, performing blank on samples of Evelyn's body tissue produces a unique fungicidal serum. Administering the serum to an infected subject will cause the mycelia to calcify, harden. That's what calcify is, right? It hardens. But if the subject's cells are already largely invaded, the serum will be fatal. Yeah, that's what happened with Jack. Since the treatment window is so small, the serum's primary use is therefore disposal of infected subjects rather than curing. Nice. In exploring the serum's potential, we found that subjecting it to blank would enhance its effects to extreme potency becoming a compound we now call e-necrotoxin, which blanks in even tiny amounts. That's the thing I have in my, in my back pocket right now. <laughs> What's been interesting to observe in Evelyn's behavior is her obsession with the concept of family. In experiments, we found on multiple occasions that infected subjects were compelled to act as her mother or father, treating her as if she were really their daughter. Hence, 
what the bakers were rambling about the whole time I was in that house. Why did she settle upon family as the theme of her mental control? Because it, it's, adults are susceptible to it. A little girl needing a family. Here, I'll help you. Oh, God! It's not that hard to figure out. This is just speculation, but it could be that she instinctively understands that a family unit is better suited to blending into social groups than a lone girl. On the other hand, well, a sentimental sort... A sentimental sort might suggest that she's making up for a perceived lack of love in her quarantined upbringing. A parent's love. That's pretty much exactly what I just said. So, yay. Oh, what the fuck? Yep. Hairs in the back of my neck stood up after that one. I was hoping to find, like, crafting materials or something in here. Not a bunch of reading! But that's still interesting, to say the least. I feel like we knew most of that already, but still. All right, here we go. Let me turn a bit. There we go. <laughs> Just want to make sure I keep facing forward on the uh, on the camera, guys. Oh no. Oh no. What? Target. Uh, target acquired. What? Oh, another one. Huh? Is that Evelyn? That's not Evelyn. E-Necrotoxin destroys cells of any subject based on the E-Series bioweapon model, used only for disposal of E-Series assets. Yeah, thanks. That's exactly what I'm here for. The toxin must first be stimulated before use. Do this by placing a sample of an E-Series cells into the Necrotoxin container. Oh, wait, no, is this that- this is- there was another one of these in the boat! Right where- right where Alan died, I think? Yeah, and it was this exact thing, I think, but a bunch of it was scrawled out, so I couldn't read it. I think this is the actual version. Okay, I'm doing it. Oh god, I'm gonna back up now. Oh, there it is. I have it now. Oh shit. Oh god, oh god. I got it. Yay. Jump scare. Jump scare. Jump scare. Jump scare. I got it. Yay. Progress means jump scare. No? Okay, good. I did it. I am gonna keep going. <laughs> so let me just take a look at that thing. Um, a special serum for disposing of E-series test subjects. It could destroy Evelyn if injected into her. Yeah, I need to find her. But Lucas, I'm imagining Lucas will maybe want to protect Evelyn. Because like he said in that video, not everyone wants to turn back the clock. So I think because he knows that's what I'm trying to do by destroying Evelyn, he's gonna stand in my way. I'm gonna have to deal with him first. Oh, okay, save station, thank god. All right, all right. That looks comfy. I wish I had that chair. Flame rounds. Okay, well, this is the thing I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get rid of the Magnum since I only have two bullets for it. Not a whole lot's happened yet and I'm so stressed out right now. Like, I'm not used to this anymore. <laughs> Every time I think I, like, get used to horror in, uh, VR horror stuff, and I'm like, alright, I've done it before, I can do it again, and then I get back into it after a couple weeks of not doing it, or a couple months in this case, and it's just, you, you think you get used to it, and you do, but then you stop playing VR for a while. I hear bobblehead. I hear bobblehead. Shut up. Where is Mr. Bobblehead? I missed him. He, he, he's down. He's down, isn't he? Wait! Nope, I see him! I can't- I can't reach him from here. Hold on. Come on, buddy. Aha! Gotcha! <laughs> Alright, got one. Oh. Something tells me I'm gonna need to get through this door. So what do I need? I don't need anything, apparently. I just, this is just, what? What? Oh, now you give me that. Okay. Thanks, you dick. Where is it? I got two. I'm gonna go ahead and put that back so it's not wasting space. I don't have the Magnum with me anymore, so I'm just gonna go put it back. Okay, here we go. I see something over there. I'm gonna check back here. These games don't anticipate you going backwards, do they? 
I must say, though, if you guys are gonna try horror in VR that isn't, you know, stand-up with move controllers and stuff, play it on a swivel chair. Like, sitting on the couch and stuff, it makes turning around and looking behind you a lot easier in a swivel chair. And, yeah, so, I also have a much more comfortable swivel chair. Can I pick that up? Yes, I can. Chemical fluid. Hey, floodlight. Okay. Uh, what am I gonna craft with this? I have a lot of herbs. And I also have a lot of ammo. I will craft more first aid. There. Okay. This looks really familiar to the other side where I came out at, but okay. Ugh. That's not ominous at all. Especially when the color changes! No! Evelyn! Oh, God. I hear her. I hear her. She's here. Let's check! Still recording! Okay, I'm going for 45 minutes already? Christ! Okay, most of that was reading. <laughs> Oh god, I'm so scared. Something's gonna come out of the water in front of me again. <laughs> and the last time that happened, I didn't like it! In fact, to quote, I don't like it. <laughs> oh, I'm getting real out last two vibes from in here now. Can I check over here, sweetie? Please? She's singing it. She's singing Go Tell Aunt Rhody. Which I guess is apparently the theme song of this game. Oh, thank God. Oh, I'm so glad I came back here. Mo of course when I put it away. Now it's give. I almost want to go back and get the Magnum now. I do. I almost do, but I'm not gonna. You know what? I'm gonna go do it. I'm gonna go do it. Fuck it. I'm gonna go do it. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go either drop the ammo back or do something. Cause I feel like this is gonna be bad. So I really wanna make sure I'm ready. Oh, this is not gonna be good. Shut up! Make sure I'm still facing forward. Yep, okay. <laughs> You see, like, there's a lot to keep track of with recording in VR, guys. Gotta make sure your capture doesn't quit out. Gotta make sure you're facing the camera. Gotta make sure your microphone's okay now that you're sitting far away from the screen. So it's kind of a pain. Why? Why? Yeah! Oh! Fucking God, Lady Jesus Christ! No! Don't say that to me! Okay! Okay! That's not good. I should. Okay. Yep. Oh god. Nope. 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 Don't want to hit that. Oh god. They're behind me too. They're behind me too. Ah. They're still behind me too. Oh god. Ah. Ah. Back. 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 Okay. I'm gonna switch back to the regular now. All right. We're good. Everything's fine. Ah, it scared me. Evelyn, you're done, bitch. I don't know what that is. Does it show up on my? No, it doesn't. Okay. <laughs> I can't see notifications in the headset. Friendly reminder. Achievements. Messages. <laughs> oh God. Going behind me, right? Nope. Good. Okay. All right. Come here, you. Wow! Okay, okay, okay. Everything's fine. I'm gonna try and conserve ammo and try and search the place. Okay. Oh god! Okay, hi. Alright. 
I don't know which way is the right way. Do I? I should probably. I probably still have to keep going up, right? So I'm gonna go this way. Oh, that's literally nothing. It's just a, just a roundabout. Okay, fine. Going up. No. God, I don't like that music. I don't see anything. Where? Oh, hello. I'll take that. Um. Can I use it? How do I? Huh? I don't know how to use remote bombs, so whatever. <laughs> I forget. <laughs> okay. This game's giving me a lot of ammo. Horror games aren't generous. They're giving it to me for a reason. Oh, fuck! Okay, Good. goodbye, goodbye, bye, bye, bye. No! Hey! Oi! Oi, me! Oh, God, in front of me! Okay. Oh, Jesus, would you stop it? Um, excuse me. You're no. Stay down. Thank you. Oh God. Okay. Scared me. Scared me. But we're good. All right. In fact, I'm gonna use my pistol for a while. Woohoo! <laughs> no. You don't frighten me, English pig dogs. <sighs> I feel a little better now. Oh. Oh, I'll take that. Whoa! Oh, that's bad. Man, I wish I knew how to use remote bombs. Oh, Jesus Christ! Ow! 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 Okay, hold on. Let me open this box. And take whatever's in it. Thank you. Oh, shit. I gotta reload! 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 I cornered! No, that, that's bad. I'm cornering myself. Come on! Blow up! Smile, you son of a bitch! Oh, shit. No! No, that, you idiot! I can't see. I can't see. He's, he's gonna blow up. He's gonna blow up. Back! Come on. No! No! No, get back! Back! No, he's blocking. I can't get out. I can't get out. I can't get out. No! No! Oh! Jesus! Oh, now's my chance! Go! Go, go, go! Oh. Ah. You're fast for being so fat! Alright, here we go. Stop it! You dick! Okay, come on. I'm gonna need you to die, okay? I, I'm, I'm gonna need you to die. I'm gonna need you to die. Oh! Oh my god. Okay. I survived somehow. I still got a lot of medicine too. Sweet. And I will definitely take more shotgun shells because I used a lot of them just now. I hit triangle to reload because I'm an idiot. All right. Oh boy, that was that was exciting. I noticed this game isn't. A, what? I noticed this game isn't a total jerk because there are very few boxes that are actually rigged. Now watch this one blow up. Nope, okay, good. <laughs> Up we go. Oh, there's gonna be a jump scare at the top of this thing, I know. Okay, still going. Oh, my neck. I see, I see the night sky. I'm not underground anymore. 
Well, I mean, I technically still am, I suppose, but... Huh! I was expecting the final showdown to take place down here. Of course, I'm not out yet, so maybe I shouldn't speak too soon. What am I doing? Not great on this. Switch back to normal, because I got more of that. Alright, we're doing alright. Flashlight would be nice. Flashlight's contextual, so yeah, I can't I can't turn it on whenever I want to. Okay. Here we go. Oh my god, claustrophobia warning. Oh my god. Okay. Save! Yay! Oh, I'll take that. You are gearing me up for a final fight right now. I found a map. I never use maps. I don't ever. I just kind of wander and <laughs> just kind of see what happens. Oh my god, I'm doing so well. All right, hold on. Wait, is it, wait, hold on. Is, is there a chest around here? There's usually a chest at the save point, but there isn't this time. Great! All right, 